having a sweet tooth. Um, I've always enjoyed gummies and, you know, why not start a gummy collection? When I heard the name Sugar Pova, I kind of put the two together and that's how it all started. But I wanted to start my own business just because I've had so much experience of working with different brands. I've sat in rooms with executives from different companies, but at the end of the day, I was always a very small part of the decision making, which is quite understandable. But I was always itching to start something on my own, being the one making all those decisions. I spent a lot of time going to the factory, perfecting the candy itself, from the little details on the packaging to the logo of the lips. Um, the, those little things were keys in, in the process, and I think that's why it took that much time. The biggest markets have been the United States, where we first launched, and Russia and Japan. And when we first launched um, the candy itself, everyone loved the logo, and we partnered up with Henry Bendel to create an accessory collection. I thought it would be fun to do something that I, I could actually sample myself and test out and change. I see it going into cosmetics a little bit. I'm a huge fan of cosmetics, um, so something down the line with that.